Hi boys and girls. Today I'm going to read you another pigeon book. It's called Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus. And Mo Willems wrote this book too. Hi, I'm the bus driver. Listen, I've got to leave for a little while. So you will, will you watch things for me until I get back? Thanks. Oh, and remember, don't let the pigeon drive the bus. And there goes the bus driver. He's leaving. I thought he'd never leave. drive the bus. What do you say, boys and girls? Please. I'll be careful. I'll tell you what. I'll just steer. My cousin Herb drives a bus almost every day. True story. Vroom, vroom, vroomy, vroom, vroom, pigeon at the wheel. No, I never get to do anything. Hey, I got an idea. Let's play. Drive the bus. I'll go first. No. Come on. Just once around the block. I'll be your best friend. How about I give you five bucks? No fair. I bet your mom would let me. What's the big deal? It's just a bus. I have dreams, you know. Fine. Are you ready? Let me drive the bus! I'm back. You didn't let the pigeon drive the bus, did you? Great. Thanks a lot. Uh-oh. Bye. Oh, look at it. It's so sad. Hey. Boys and girls, I want you to think in your mind, inside of your head quietly, what is the pigeon thinking? Are you ready? This is going to show you what he's thinking. He's thinking that he wants to drive the truck. Are you going to let him drive the truck? That's the end of Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus. I hope you enjoyed our story today.